Hey, we're back again, and let me get right to this email list cleaning feature just for you. Now, one of the coolest things about our email module is that there is also a list cleaning feature. So you can enter uh, essentially any strings or lines of emails that you don't want to accept. So for example, if you wanted to exclude emails which contain, for example, the string webmaster at, you would just simply type in the string that you want to include right there. And then whenever you are uploading the list by clicking this button, it's going to automatically remove any of those strings. We've also included a pre-list of very common spam trap strings that you may encounter in different lists from harvesting. Obviously, you want to remove those by clicking the uh, checkbox here. And you can see that there's a string of various uh, spam traps or honey pots, as you know some people call them. Now, there's nothing illegal about bulk mailing. But the problem is, is when you get into these spam traps, you run into issues where like your IP address or your domain name uh, can uh, get blacklisted. So to help avoid that, you would probably most likely want to choose the option to remove common spam trap strings. Uh, that way you're avoiding some of these spam filters out there. Uh, they're constantly creating lots of different uh, filters out there so you know you may find additional uh, strings out there or uh, additional honey pots that you encounter and you can also include this in there as well. So it's a pretty cool feature. If your list uh, contains um, duplicates you want to make sure that you're able to remove those duplicates you don't want to have to send an email out to you know the same person two or three times you'll probably most likely want to make sure you check that remove duplicates uh, option as well that's the sum of it once you check your options here of how you're going to import your list either by importing the emails from your computer or importing them from the Pygon bot harvesting campaign itself then you'll check these two boxes here and click upload list. I don't actually have a list I'm going to upload right now, but uh, that would be the, the process that you'd want to take. And you can also export out a cleaned email list. So let's say you were you didn't even want to send emails for example and you just wanted to clean your email list you can use this application really simply to upload your emails uh, select the common the common spam trap strings and remove duplicates add any other additional strings that you may want hit upload list then you're gonna see in this section the number of emails that were cleaned out and then you could go to the report for export clean email list and hit generate report so, again, as a summary and a wrap-up, Pygonbot just got more power.